the New York City mayor, mm -hmm. Mayor Adams, will convert his city paycheck into cryptocurrencies Ooh. via Coinbase. Ooh, which I cryptocurrency? I wonder. Oh, it was New York City Mayor Eric Adams said Thursday that his first paycheck, which arrives on Friday, will be converted from U.S. dollars into cryptocurrency. He will convert the paycheck into Bitcoin and Ethereum. You know why this is kind of big? It's kind of big because this is a government official doing it. Yes. You know, that's that's what makes this an interesting story. A government official is doing this, which is legit, which really legitimizes the feasibility of cryptocurrency within for, for the rest of us you know mere ants mere worker ants that i'm wondering how other politicians feel about that how do you feel about yep. that i'm totally okay with it people can spend their money anyway they want to spend their money mm -hmm. uh, like the, the idea was a back and forth part back and forth to miami mayor francis uh, suarez who mm -hmm. said in november he'd take his next paycheck to, into bitcoin so they're like oh we're going back and forth so and, is it you know, is it Mm -hmm. is it the entire check like i've heard like people doing this before like there's a football player that's got a certain portion of his check that is going into cryptocurrency and the rest is is going into what what's the term fiat money you know this is mm, fiat term? money yeah real fiat money fiat, fiat money, money. Yeah. real money um so is he doing like the he's doing the whole shebang in crypto no shebang wow. in cryptocurrency that's and what's so funny, funny about that is the U.S. Department of Labor rules prohibit New York City, a New York City, from paying employees in cryptocurrencies? However, hence the post-payment conversion on Coinbase. So you can't pay in cryptocurrency, oh, that's but he's loophole. taking it and converting it into crypto. Right. Currency. Well, then he's not really getting paid in cryptocurrency. This this article is is silly. Then. Yeah. Because I mean, because if I took my it. paycheck and bought donuts, I can't say I yeah. I've been paid in donuts. That's that's ridiculous. <laughs> oh well, then that's <laughs> I like not how you that's, said that. That's that's not well, as ballsy as I. <laughs> yeah, that's not yeah. as ballsy as I thought. You're not really in getting cryptocurrency. paid in cryptocurrency. You're just choosing to put the you're money that you've been paid. Yeah. Okay, that's yeah. different. That's different. And for a and second, so funny I was about to be story. like, wow. Okay, go ahead. What's, what's crazy about that story? Crypto.com admits that over thirty million dollars was stolen by hackers. Oh, I'm I'm actually surprised it's that low. To tell you the truth, I'm I'm actually a little surprised it's that low. I kind of expected like 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 I'm sure like banks swindle that much daily from from, yeah, I'm from sure common they do citizens. Too. I'm really sure, pretty sure they do. <laughs> I'm sure the FDIC covers banks what, every day. Yeah, every that's day, what I'm saying. Day. So thirty million over the course of crypto's life seems seems kind of like a yeah you know, yeah. I mean, I guess we I guess they, we should they, raise some red flags. They they, huh? they, they, they they took it from four hundred eighty three crypto dot com users four hundred eighty three uh -huh. users. I'm like, that's not that many users. I'm pretty sure they're in the tens of thousands and not a million users by now. That's what I would think. But so yeah, it's like sixty six thousand per person. So did they use like the Superman hack where they take like a fraction of a fraction of a penny off of every user and then use compound interest? I don't know. I know. Let me see. I know Let I'm geeking out. No, I seriously said that's how it is. I'm just giving giving a shout out to my what is it, my Superman three all stars out there that, that, that caught that terrible old school reference. <laughs> it doesn't say. Oh. But it's, it was like people got their passwords hacked. Mostly, ah. And they then they got they got money taken from them. That sounds about right. I mean, that sounds about right. Learn. That's why you turn on. That's why you turn on two-factor authentication on everything. Or turn it on you all just hit a button. Or mm -hmm. actually physically keep your digital currency on a separate hard drive that is not connected to the internet. Yes, There's a that. ledger. Yes, I mean, but you just you can't know. lose your ledger. I got Bitcoin no. sitting on a hard drive somewhere, on a little thumb drive somewhere around my house. God, I wish, man. I've heard. I got I've a heard. couple of Bitcoins in, like like oh. seven of them. Oh my God! What are you doing right now? You should be tearing your house down right now. You should be getting some bomb sniffing dogs and tell them to go for it. I, mean, I know where it's at. I know where it's at. I just have to check the hard drive. I haven't checked the hard drive. Golly, man! Ugh. I made the mistake of selling off some Bitcoin too early, and I'm like, I'm not selling so not I. one more. So not I didn't one sell. More. I didn't sell full coins, but. I had sold, I sold some for, for stuff that was absolutely like, ridiculous ugh. and stupid. Now I'm like. Wah, 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 wah.